Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com. With a one box break of 2021-22, Panini Prison Basketball, one spot gets you two teams. This is random team break number three. All card ship. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Congrats to the winners of the spot in the filler that we did, and congrats, or a thanks to the people who just bought their spot straight up. However you got in, I appreciate it. Let's double you up like Sir Mix a lot. Oh, double up. Oh, oh. Roll it. Randomize it one and a four five times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, and five. After five times, we got Tristan down to Tristan with spots that he won in the filler. One and a four five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and fingers crossed five times. Good luck. After five, we got OKC down to Toronto. All right, let's sort this by that. All right, Tristan, you got OKC. Justin with the Kings. Chris with the Sixers. Daniel with the Suns. Robert with the Hawks. Nick with the T-Wolves. Justin with the Nuggets. Kyle with the Pistons. Robert with the Wizards. Nick with the Knicks. Nick with the Knicks. Robert with the Clippers. Justin with the Pelicans. Chris with the Spurs. Nick with the Celtics and Bulls. Chad with the Nets. Justin with the Jazz. Chad with the Rockets. Chris, Grizzlies and Heat. Chad with the Mavs. Robert with the Blazers, Chad with the Magic, Kyle with the Cavs, Chad with the Pacers, Bennett with the Warriors, Daniel with the Hornets, Bennett with the Lakers, Chad with the Bucks, and Tristan with the Raptors. Bennett, you hear that? The LeBron news. Sad times. Hornets, Lamelo, broken foot. You see that, Chris Jasper? Yeah? I mean, there's only 20 games left, but yeah, he's done for the year. He has a broken ankle, I saw. Like a fractured ankle or something? Yeah, like that. I mean, that's like months. That's months off. It's like three, four months. I mean, he'll be ready for the next regular season. But he, He's been so lucky this year with injuries. It's that, it really is that ankle and that foot. Ball family. Lonzo, too. Take care of your legs, fellas. Take care of your legs, fellas. All right, we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the one-box break. Be right back. All right, unpause. No deals. We're done here on a Monday night. Really solid night for us. Thank you very much, everybody. It's our last break of the night. We'll be back tomorrow. I'll be back tomorrow, 3 o'clock Pacific, 6 o'clock Eastern. And we'll do this silliness all over again. We'll talk sports, talk a little pop culture, definitely music. Sometimes video games, sometimes Warhammer. Gabe's into the Warhammer. Chilo's in that Warhammer rabbit hole. Start playing some D&D, Chilo, then we can talk about yeah. this. Well, D&D, you know, uh, Stranger Things has kind of revived D&D. I, I Thanks to that. But are you going to be one of those I was playing it before Stranger Things guy? He's nodding his head. Yeah. <laughs> Have you met me? It's true. Fair, I'm, fair, I'm fair. the most pretentious person here. That's right. Great. Oh, someone has to be. Someone has to be. Someone has to be. All right. Second stack. Yeah, we don't we don't know nothing about Space Marines and the Imperium. Now, Gilo, are you actually playing others in this? Are have you reached that level where you're find, seeking out other members of this community and playing against them? Gilo's played D and D before, and that's dedication I couldn't really handle. Oh, come you! Warhammer is a is a, a completely different kind of shard. D and D the, is not the board cool. looks really cool though. The board doesn't. You know, in the figure, the but there's figure, a, the are a lot there is a uh, Warhammer kind of thing for Star Wars, which I yes. would probably, uh, which I would probably, if I might just buy it just to display it and not know, even play it. But before we get into a completely nerdy thing, two different things. First, there is like a tabletop role playing game for Star Wars called GURPS. That now that is an absolute hassle and a half. It's horrible. Oh. Don't even bother. Uh, there is a D and D version of Star Wars, oh. you know, five E tabletop, all that stuff. But boy, is 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 that module expensive? Oh, is it? We're talking a few hundred bucks for just the basic stuff. As opposed to what? You, I mean, you can get the starter kit and all the all the essential handbooks for like a combined two hundred bucks. It's so easy for just regular D and D. That Star Wars stuff though, they didn't make a lot of it. Oh, it's not expensive. Silver Jonathan Kaminga, how's he doing these days? Bennett with the Warriors. He's a, he's 
That's a, I, would, I would assume some minutes increase with the staff injury, with, with the staff. all hands on deck thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to see him get some more more minutes. John Kaminga was not in the lineup the most. Oh, he was. Sorry, he's at the top. Power forward, twenty-seven minutes, thirteen points, five rebounds, an assist, a steal, plus four. We'll take that. Okay. I mean, we want him to do better for Bennett, who just got his silver rookie right there. There's a hyper Carl Anthony Towns. He's the youngest NBA champion of all time. I think he's. Got Is that really? Is time. that right? Yeah. Yeah, we'll let him marinate. There's James Booknight, and we got a Moses Moody rookie auto. That's another one for Bennett. Warriors, come out to play. Here's a base, Cameron Thomas as well. Had a really good stretch of those 40-point games. Let's see, we got a hyper parallel Booknight. We'll, we'll sleeve that up too. Uh, Chad Cromwell has the Nets, and the out of 25 Booknight is uh, for D'Lo. Daniel and the Hornets. There's a Scotty Barnes. Do oh, I see there's a Jonathan Kaminga? Silver Jamal Murray. I thought that was going to be some sort of tie-dye, but then I realized this is Prism and only select as tie-dye. Scotty Barnes with Toronto. Tristan in Toronto gets the base Scotty Barnes rookie card. Jaden McDaniels, Red Wave, not numbered. Chris Weber, Hyper, not numbered. Rex used to play a game called Merp. It was like D&D. I mean, I don't know. D&D kind of changed the, changed the game, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, tabletops have been around for you know, 50, 60, 70 years now. Warhammer, so G-Lo, Gabe is still learning, but they teach how to play at the store, but you're more into Good. the painting right now. He says, Honest, it's, says it's therapeutic. Honestly, Gilo, if you get good enough at it, you can offer that service as a premium. Mm, painting I mean, service? Yeah. I, I, I know a friend who got into it. Same thing. Side hustle. She liked the minis. She thought it was fun to do and therapeutic. And she would you know, she would charge by the hour eventually. Wow. DeAndre Hunter, Hawks, Red, Robert with the Hawks. You get all sorts of commentary here at Jaspies during a break. There's Michael Porter Jr. We were just talking about him earlier today, watching him. Red Wave. Nikola Jokic, 48 out of 75. You get the 75th anniversary diamond. Step and repeat on the background. M MVP? Another yes. one for him? I, I don't even think it's close at this Yeah, point. I don't think so either. That's Denver. That'll be for Justin Weber. We'll have to look at the odds at some point on that. You know what, Gilo? That, the, that might be music to me and Chris's ears. Gabe wants to uh, get a board game night going after the Jaspies golf tournament. Oh man! Ooh, that's full, a day. Full day. That's a day. Fun day. That's a day. Do a little D and D after the Jaspies yeah, golf I would, tournament. I would, I would DM something for people. I've done it a few times. That'd be pretty. That'd be pretty fun. Ninety out of one ninety nine. Tony Kukoc. Bulls. That's going to go to Nick Ozer. Nick with that one. TJ Warren Silver, Fearless, and Anthony Hardaway. And for the Clippers, Keon Johnson, Rookie Auto. For the Clip Show, that's going to be for Robert and the Clippers. Bruce Brown, Red Wave, Lonzo. Let's see if we can find some parallels there before we close this break out. Buddy Heald, Silver, Pascal Siakam, Red, 299 for Toronto. Tristan with the Raptors. And the last bit, good luck. Looks like we've got a Pulsar coming up. Pulsar Kelly Olenek. we got a David Robinson, the Admiral. 91 out of 125. Blue cracked ice for the Spurs. Chris Butler. And the last bit, we've got Valanchunas, Bertans, and Denny Avija. 
There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Another one box break loaded up in the store. One spot gets you two teams. And if you don't like that, you can join the filler to try to win a spot for a fraction of the price. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. That was random team break number three. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.